Welcome, 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 welcome. We're going to do move on. My Taurus, okay? We're going to do raw love for the first half of December. Um, I will tell you, I am, this is going to be my, like, Tyridian's energy, okay? And, um, oh, all of my oils. And this is going to be the external energy. All right, but you got to remember it's a general for thousands, so it could possibly go the other way around. But let's find out what's going on with my my Tavidians. My my Tavidians, I just love all you guys. Well, this definitely has to do with your foundation because I've cut this quite a few times and it still ends up being right there. See, that's foundation too. So. I'm not saying you're going to have a tower moment, but this has to do with your foundation. So, let's see what's going on. I'm trying to feel some doubt. I'm trying to feel some doubt. What's that about? What's going on, Taurus? Got the page of wands. Is that four of wands reversed? The fool reversed. Damn. What? What is the freaking deal? Holy shit! Holy tornadoes! What? What? Adios, I'm going to pray for you guys, okay? Friggle sticks. All right. You want a new start. You want to take an adventure. But what is going on? Holy shit. But you're bent out of shape, okay? Um... You feel like you you feel like you can't have a new style. You feel like your foundation's crumbling. Some of you are moving and you have no choice and you're sad as shit and you feel like it's unjustified and some of you are just straight up not putting effort into spirituality. You're pissed at the universe. That's for some, okay? Others, you're just you're tired. You're tired. You're not grounded. You feel like you made a foolish decision when it comes to love. Regardless, it was still unjustified or you were dealing with a Libra. But, like, then you got the Hierophant here, which I don't think that's you. I, I think you guys are taking on the page of wands. But you're not putting effort into something that has to do with your foundation. A new start. I think you think it would be foolish. You're like, F this. I, you're not having something. Holy shit. External energy. Let me see the external energy before I dig. Okay. The love is reversed. Somebody not making a decision. All right. Ten of cups reversed. Someone's not happy. There's that, there's that guilt. Someone's got a lot of guilt right now. All right. The knight of wands. The king of pence. I think somebody who was in and out of your life. A lot now has guilty. This person wants to rush in with some type of message. And they're guilty. They're not happy with decisions they've made. But it looks to me they want something solid. Again, Cappy and, Cappy and uh, Cancer had the court couples like that too. The magician. This person's manifesting them manifesting you back into your life um knight of pence another messenger this person's manifesting you right back into their life that has nothing to do with tricky shit that's them calling you in okay they know exactly who you are to them you guys are coming up as a court couple. 
Okay. To me, you're tired. I don't, I don't think, I think you think if you even allow this person in your home, you're going to make a foolish decision right off the bat. And I, I honestly feel like for some of you, there's so much pain that I think, I, I, I feel like you don't even want to chance it because whatever happened in the past was just too much for you to handle. Your thoughts are not even about putting effort into this, but I'm telling you with the higher thought, to me, this is spiritual. You, it's like you don't want to see the connection either with the king of swords or the king of pence. Tell me about justice reversed. Judgment reversed. I, this, I think somebody is going to want a second chance and you're not having it. You, you don't even want to make that judgment call. Tell me about the high font reversed. All right. Yeah. You don't even want to make that judgment call. Yeah. I don't know if you got two people fighting over you right now, but you're like, nope. You're blindfolded on, you're, you're taking yourself out of the equation, and you're letting the divine do the work. And until the divine steps in, you're not putting no effort into nothing. You're messing with the divine right now. Kind of, sort of. Whether you see it or not. It's either that or you blatantly just don't give a flying fuck anymore. But you're going to have to make a decision. Someone's manifesting you back in. This decision is going to have to do with this person. Tell me about the four of wands reversed. I honestly feel like if you let this person, if you feel like if you let this person back into your home, it's already a foolish decision. All right? Yeah, see, you passed in the King of Swords. I said that to you. Okay? This is your past coming back around. And this is what this is. What this is. I, I really think you're on a journey, and but you're tired. You're tired, and this person wants to come to your home and talk to you. And you're just having a hard time with it, okay? I, I really, truly feel like if you, I truly feel if you think you let this person into your home, you're going to make a foolish decision. But here's the deal. Obviously, it's unjustified, okay? But you have no choice but to use your decision. This is also telling me that the divine, they're out of it. It's on you. They're out of it. They guided it in, and now it's on you whether or not you're going to put effort into it. Okay? This other person, they're not happy. It took them a long time to make a decision, I'll tell you that. And it was probably the king of swords. Okay? They chose somebody else. They thought the grass was greener on the other side situation, and they're not happy either. They got a lot of guilt, but they want to come in. This was probably somebody who was in and out any, in and out anyway, okay? But now they want to come in with a message. To me, it's more in and out, in and out, and they feel guilty because they could have had something solid. They're manifesting you back into your life. They're going to come and deliver a message. They want to give you time, okay? So I don't even need to clarify anything there because that's clear as day. I will clarify the magician. Don't force it because it, it split the deck and then money, okay? So this is an additional message. Don't force it. Allow that shit to come to you. And then money. Make it rain, okay? So I, I kind of feel like this one's blatantly ignoring something because it could be, you know, they're too focused elsewhere. I don't know. But this person, oh, tell me about the magician. There, this is straight up manifest, manifestation. Manifest, manifesting this right back into their lives. Okay, yeah, a contract. Coming back together. Having a new start, even out the scales. They were probably bugging for a long time, too. It's probably why it took so long for them to come in. Now they feel like they missed an opportunity. Okay, so it's definitely coming back around. Additional messages from my tourists. What's up? I do not. Thank you, though. Hold on, I'm going to wrap this up. Give me two minutes. 
It's not everyone else's fault, it's yours. You are a grown-ass adult. Stop blaming others for your shit. So this is either for you or the cross-watcher, whomever it goes towards, okay? It says, step away from the crazy making. Diet for a hot second. Kale and, uh, what's that word? Tastes like ass. <laughs> oh, my God. Step away from the diet is what they're saying, okay? For realsies. All right. It says, eat some yummy shit. Bacon, cheese, beer. I know this isn't for me because I eat that shit all the time. All right. But um, what is that called again? Spina, spina, spina is something like that. But they're saying it tastes like ass. All right. Stop being a stickler for who's being a stickler. You know, like put something yummy in your mouth. You, you're putting, someone's putting way too many restrictions on themselves. Okay. <laughs> oh my goodness. I love you guys. Bye. All right. JD, babe, what's up?